Hi, I'm Rodney Miller. And I'm Jan Carl. Thanks so much for choosing to watch this clip from our Small Town Big Deal YouTube channel. For full episodes, go to our website. Now, enjoy the video. Amy and Jolie Sykes are the self-proclaimed purveyors of the world's finest junk. Their unique design style mixes vintage with a whole bunch of Texas spirit. This is not serious. This is not Martha Stewart approved. This is fun. We want it to be theater. We want people to walk in here and be happy. But we think your home should be that way too. Yeah. And this is the way our homes look. <laughs> your home should reflect you and we hope that we're all fun. These creative geniuses garnered national attention when they were tapped by HGTV to have their very own design show as well as on the Great American Country Network. They've also worked with country stars Miranda Lambert and Dirks Bentley, just to name a few. How did this whole thing begin for you all? Well, so we started in 1998 and uh, we were just a few years out of college and so we really just kind of wanted to do something better than sitting at a desk job every day and so anyway we just decided to start doing the flea market thing with our mom thinking we would come up with our master plan you know our grand scheme in the meantime fell in love with the road fell in love with the flea market and decided okay this is the deal they now have a collection offered at Pottery Barn Kids they're the authors of a New York Times bestseller and the owners of the Wander Inn that has the junk gypsy signature all over it the sisters truly do love each other, and the fact they work together day in and day out is pretty special. But I was wondering... And your sisters, now, do you ever, like, yes. have sister fights? No, because no. she knows I'm the boss. Yeah, well, <laughs> I'm the older, smarter one. I'm the taller one. You'll wait to fight when you retire. We'll put it on our calendar. Yeah, we're going to schedule we're an argument. We're going to next week. Yes, <laughs> but we just, but we're too busy. Not this week, okay. yeah. The sisters may work with celebrities and music stars, but they are as down to earth as you can get. And you are rocking the fanny pack. What this young designer-to-be was grinning from ear to ear when Amy and Jolie signed her cast and took their picture with her. The Junk Gypsy store is so impressive. If you put the charm of farmhouse style, the beat of rock and roll, and the heart of Texas in a blender, well, you get a taste of the Junk Gypsy store. And there were no shortage of customers or fans. Yeah! We have different sections of the store. Like this will be like our glamper section. It's very girly. We've got cactus and a... Wait, I don't think it's girly at all. <laughs> I like to be well-rounded, but it's a little frilly in here for me. Imagine a vintage tractor, <laughs> but this is the seat. It yeah. would feel good, but I'm not sure I can go there. <laughs> you would be a happy camper. I really think Rodney needs that pink fur pillow for his tractor. Amy, I don't care how sore my butt gets, that is not going to happen. We have a lot of cow skulls in the store. We normally add flowers to them. Why not? Everything's better with silk flowers and glitter. That's right. And Amy found these, these great old concrete, the seven dwarves, seven all seven. seven. And people keep saying, will you sell just one? I'm like, I can ethically not separate them. No, that would not be right. They've been together for a long time. Because I was going to ask just for grumpy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, I'm not grumpy. I have no chance You're today. You're so outnumbered. <laughs> you know, that's a good one. Yeah. You know, Rodney's just getting a little taste of his own medicine. Best day ever. You know, Rodney tries to give off this, like, macho man, kind of manly man, rah, rah, rah kind of vibe. But I saw him eyeing all the sparkles in there, and I know this is what he really wants to be driving. How's this for vintage? You are not touching any of my tractors. <laughs> What, you got a problem with the chalkboard thing? Yes, and, and the frill on what, the... What about the chandelier? Is that not approved? <laughs> <laughs> He's like mind blown. <laughs> and of course, the girl's got to have her boots. Oh. We decided if you're going to have an addiction, it might as well be good for you. And good for the world. Yeah, because everybody's happy in cowboy boots. You would look good in those, Rodney. I wonder if they got those in 11 and a half, but just leather and no bedazzling. If you were at the flea market and you were a dance hall queen, this is what you would be wearing in <laughs> glitter saddle, you know. Did you guys do that? We yes. did. I mean, if, if anything stays still very long around here, it ends up with glitter on it. Yes. <laughs> that, consider that your fair <laughs> warning. <laughs> consider that your fair warning. <laughs> I feel bad. Rodney being teased by all of us girls. I do. Sort of. Amy and Jolie are so cute. I'll let them pick on me any day. Just in case you need, look, oh, this is for you when you have your tractor. Oh, yes. <laughs> that is some good bling right there. 
The junk gypsies may have given me a bit of a hard time, but I was so very impressed with how these sisters created a huge business by following their dreams. Every six months when this flea market rolls around, it's like the most exciting, it's like Christmas to us. We get all giddy and jittery and itchy and we just can't wait to get out there. Thanks for coming. Oh my gosh, oh, it's so much fun. We had a good time. I, I would hug yes. you, but I can't. Yes. Y'all come back soon, okay? Oh, this yeah. is all jams to just FYI. Oh my gosh, I know, but you know what? You can find something later. Bye. Bye. Thanks for watching this clip from Small Town Big Deal. Don't forget to click the subscribe button and be sure to click the bell so you'll be notified when we upload new videos. Also, click the like button. To see full episodes, go to www.smalltownbigdeal.com.